What's going on guys? In this video, we're gonna be taking a look at a new tool that I put together that is going to very easily allow you to create a global favorites wheel. Now going forward, there's gonna be a favorites wheel included right above the toolkit. And if we go in there, you're going to have the favorites manager. Favorites manager is also available in the toolkit and you can also access it on the D drive, under utilities, there's gonna be a favorites manager folder. So you can basically do any of this right from Windows without even starting Hyperspin. All right, so let's start it up and take a quick look. So starting with add to favorites, if we go in there, you have a list of systems. You can select it with your trackball, with your mouse, or you can type in the search. I typed in Nintendo and it only shows me the Nintendo systems. If I select Nintendo Entertainment System, I get a list of games. I select 10 yard fight and I click add game. Game has been successfully added. Click okay. Now, if I click finish, the game is not going to be here. So I have to exit out of favorites and then go back into favorites. And now I have 10 yard fight with all of the artwork and video. Let's go back up to favorites manager, start it up again, go add to favorites again. And I'm just going to type in Wii U. I'm going to select Wii U. If I wanted to type a game name here, I can do that, but I'm just going to select adventure time, add game and it added it successfully. Go ahead and add some MAME games. Type in MAME, select MAME. Now this one, you have to give it a few seconds because it's a very large list. So you have to give it a few seconds to populate. So let's just wait for it. There we go. Now I can just type in a search, select the game, add game, successful. Click OK. Now notice it refreshed, but that didn't actually refresh. Let's scroll down a little bit. This is a trick that you can use. Wait for it to scroll back up on its own. Now it's good to go. Let's add another game. Add game. Successful. OK. Now let's go to finish and let's exit out of favorites where it refreshes and go back in. Now all of our games are here with the artwork. Now, notice Adventure Time has a box art that is in front of the CD, whereas this game has a box art that is behind the cartridge. So to fix that, we go to Favorites Manager again, and we go to Swap Artwork. Select the game, Adventure Time, Swap Artwork, click OK, and click Finish. Now this one, you don't have to exit out of Favorites because the game is not selected, so when you select it, it's already gonna be correct. So let's go down again, that's good. And now that's good. All right, and finally, let's take a look at remove games. So favorites manager, let's go to remove from favorites, select the game, remove game. Are you sure? Yes, game's been removed. Now, if we go to finish, exit out, go back in. Now that game is gone. You can also remove all. So favorites manager, remove from favorites, remove all. It's going to ask you, are you sure it can be undone? So say yes, click OK. Now, if you exit out and you go back in, all the games are gone and only the favorites manager is left. All right, guys, I really hope you guys enjoy this new tool. I'm really liking it. I'll see you guys in the next video.